What is up guys? Welcome back to a brand new video. We got Zoya in the house. Literally in the house. And I'm super glad you guys liked our previous life hack video and our food challenge. So today we decided to combine these two video ideas and we're gonna show you the viral Tic Tac food hacks. Are you ready? Mm. Why not? Let's do it! <laughs> Guys, I see that 70% are not subscribed. Are you good? So I need all of you guys to hit the subscribe button, leave a big thumbs up on the video if you like the TikTok series so far, and let's get started with food tag number one. Okay, so for our first food tag, we will making an Oreo mug cake. It's not Oreo, it's right, it's not knockoff Oreo. We are going to make a cake out of this. How is that gonna work? Okay, so basically guys, all you need is Oreo or whatever this is, right? Some fake stuff. You need a mug or a bowl and you need milk. So, what are we gonna do? We're gonna take them out, we're gonna crush them in the bowl. So take around four or five Oreos. I should be inside that So, we have six Oreos right here. We're gonna add a little bit of milk and then, oh my God. God. Sorry. So we're gonna add a little bit of milk. Don't add too much, just a slight amount. So next step is crushing the Oreos. You don't have to break the bowl. Be gentle. Okay guys, when you finish mashing it, it should look like this. Very nice, Zoya. Did you eat half of it? Zoya? Okay, next step, we're gonna put that in the microwave for one minute. Ice cream sandwiches. Woo! So all you guys need is a big tub of ice cream and you need some cookies or if you're healthy like me, you know, you can also get some crackers. Healthy? Excuse me? We will taking this ice cream. Uh, you know you shouldn't be doing this. All we have to do is cut the top in half. And then you take the ice cream, you cut it in half, one for you and one for me. And then we're gonna take the crackers and we're gonna put them on top. And one on the bottom, and we got some put ice cream back. sandwiches. Put this back right now. Mmm. Wanna try it? No. That's not how you do it. Okay, Zoya, you're gonna show me how you do it, okay? You're supposed to shape it like the ice cream. Oh my god. You're so detailed, Zoya. Now it's nice. Wow, that looks pretty good. Look at this. Okay, have a try. <laughs> Do you have your teeth there? <laughs> <laughs> Ice cream sandwich. Cheers. Yours is not a sandwich, it's a break. Mmm. Mmm. It's definitely a success, guys. Off to trick number three. Chris, can you bring me the ice cream, please? Of course. Here we go. Oh, it's melted. I, I'm sorry, I forgot to put it in the fridge. What, what are we gonna it? do? It's, it's melted now. Well, lucky for you, there's a food hack for this. Oh, thank God. Okay, so what are you gonna do with it? I'm gonna need to bring a few things. Yo, what do we have here? We got three eggs, we got a cake mix. What kind of cake mix? We got melted ice cream, and we're gonna blend all this together. And bake a cake. And bake a cake with melted ice cream. Okay, let's do it, guys. Our first stick, I'm gonna crack the eggs all in the bowl. Yep. Wow. Okay, that is done. Uh, Wait, ah! Sorry. Be kute. <laughs> now we whisk them. Whiskey? <laughs> whisk them. Oh, whisk. Now we're gonna put uh, half of the ice cream in it. Ice cream and eggs, guys. Maybe that omelette? And then how much of that cake mix do we need? I think we need a big bowl. So guys, unfortunately we needed a bigger pot, so we're gonna use that one like, you know, Dizzy style. And we're gonna put... Put. <laughs> and we're gonna put the whole cake mix inside as well. And can we do it? No! I mean, let's hope this works, otherwise, because if, if it works, it'll be a coconut ice a coconut chocolate ice cream cake. Voila! That looks good. So, Zoya stirred it for around an hour? For no. like two minutes. For like two minutes, okay. And now what we did, we got one of these baking things here and we're gonna put some oil or butter in so it doesn't stick. You when you, yeah, that's what I said. And now we're gonna pour it in, oh my God, ooh. 
Ooh, yes. <laughs> oh, yes. 175, 70 grades, a preheated oven, and put this in for 45 minutes, and let's hope that this works. Okay. Woo! Okay, do you think this is gonna work? Yes. An ice cream cake, I've never heard about this before. If you guys wanna see if this ice cream transform into a cake, stay until the end and leave a big like for Zoya. <laughs> okay, ladies and gentlemen, we got Xavi Jeffrey in the house. What? Oh my god. <laughs> so, Xavi, I have a food tag for you. Okay, do you see this chocolate bar? Mm -hmm. We can turn this chocolate bar into infinity chocolate. You wanna see the trick? Sure. Oh, okay. Okay, so all you need to do, guys, get the knife and you have to cut it from this side over here. Okay, guys, now what you're gonna do is you're gonna break two of these pieces off, you can put it together, and you take the top piece, and voila! We got two extra pieces, one for you and one for me. Cheers. Cheers, bro. <laughs> So guys, for our next hack, we're gonna use these super boring instant noodles and turn them into a Pan-Asian meal. So the trick is to add a bit of oil! <laughs> <laughs> so the trick is to make it fancy, uh, add a bit of oil. <laughs> Look at the spoon! <laughs> oh my god. Whoa! So we add oil and an egg and <laughs> the bottle. And then we fold it and it becomes fancy ramen. Guys, I'm not kidding, it's actually really delicious. You can sprinkle some other spices if you like. Oh, that looks delicious. So guys, the noodles, ooh, they look really good. Should we try it out? Yeah. I don't know how to use those. Do you think there's a line pack? There's really straws. Lucky there's a food tag for this. So all you need is take your chopsticks, take a paper straw or a plastic straw, and what you have to do is you cut exactly the same size on the other side. So you have that bendy bit. And you just use your chopsticks, put them in the ends. And voila! This is cool! Can I eat right now? Oh my god! Mmm! <laughs> oh, yeah, it's fine. Come on, it's fine. I'm going to next Alrighty, guys, the next hack is the watermelon slice egg. All we need to do is the watermelon. Put it on your table, grab a kitchen knife. Ah, oh, that's so good. And we're going to cut the top off. Just like that. Put it away. And now we grab a printer's pack, an empty one. Because Zoya ate it all already. <laughs> <laughs> and you have to put it over here. And now what you're gonna do is you smack it in all the way into the watermelon. Oh my god. Uh, take it out. Ooh, that is juicy. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> and nothing is inside. <laughs> and now you gotta slice that part on the other side. Or maybe I should have sliced both parts? No, it's too late. And, hello! <laughs> now you push the Pringles pack through, and look at that. And here we go, oh, 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 oh! Wow, this is cool. And then guys, you can just take your knife and chop like really nice slices. I give it a big thumbs up, this is an amazing trick, guys. Chris, I want fresh fruit juice. Do I look like I got a juicy here? Can you please check it out of the way? Look at this melon. I want fresh. Lucky guys, there's a food tag. All you need is a French press. Open the French press. Put in some watermelon. You can use these slices. They're perfect. Actually, they are perfect. <laughs> that is crazy. Put in some slices. And then the TikTok said if you put it in right now and squeeze, it's going to come up juicy. Do you think it's going to work? I have no idea. So apparently guys, you have to cut them first because this is not going to work out at all. So now that we have chopped the watermelon to pieces, we're going to see if the hack is working. Ready? One, two, three, go. Oh, 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 oh. 
drunk. Wow, we get some juice. <laughs> Uh, I don't think this hack is working, guys. Definitely not enough juice. We're gonna see what we can do here. I mean, <laughs> we've got a little bit. But we're wasting a lot of milk. But we're wasting a lot of milk. Maybe if you do it like that. Uh, okay, and then you break the French press, I guess. So, guys, this trick is definitely not working. This is not worth it to put so many watermelon slices in. Uh, oh my god, the cake looks so good! <laughs> And with us we have Hash here. Hash is gonna try the cake and you're gonna tell me what's inside. Okay, what ingredients is Let me inside? Slice it for you. Oh. oh my god. Put this I can't believe this works. Nice and moist. Oh my god, guys, look at this. Mm. <laughs> okay, Hash is gonna try a little bit and you tell me what is inside, okay? Try a little bit. Hash here, what is inside? What are the ingredients? What do you think? Milk, coconut, and uh, of course sugar. <laughs> so far so good. But do, you don't know is how many is candle ice cream in it. You put ice cream. Ice cream. Nice, nice, eh? I forgot to put it in the fridge and we used it to make this amazing cake. And guys, oh my god. So that's it for the vlog guys. We hope that you like the TikTok viral food hacks. Do try them and let us know if they work for you as well. And don't forget to subscribe, join the Gora gang, leave a big thumbs up on the video if you like it. Zoya was working really hard. I also linked her makeup tutorial channel in the link in the description. <laughs> and I will see you guys next week with a new video. Peace out and... <laughs>